Imagine this, Earth's about to get a cosmic visitor, but not the kind you're thinking of. No, we're not talking about a close encounter with an alien mothership or some massive asteroid barreling towards us like a scene from Armageddon. This is a much smaller, way less dramatic guest. Think the size of a house, maybe your neighborhood coffee shop. It's an asteroid, but not just any asteroid. This one's going to hitch a ride around Earth for a couple of months, briefly becoming a mini-moon. That's right, Earth's getting a temporary sidekick, and its name is 2024 PT5. So what's the deal with this mini-moon? Why is it such a big deal? Stick around because we're about to dive into what makes 2024 PT5 so special, how it's getting caught up in Earth's gravity, and why scientists are geeking out over it. Plus, we'll take a look at what these fleeting cosmic visitors teach us about planetary defense. Yep, this tiny space rock actually has some pretty big implications. First off, how do we even know about this little cosmic hitchhiker? Well, back in August 2024, a state-of-the-art asteroid detection system called ATLAS, yes, like the Titan who held up the sky, spotted it. Now, ATLAS is designed to be on the lookout for asteroids that might pose a threat to Earth. So when 2024 PT-5 popped up on its radar, it definitely got people's attention. But here's the good news. While 2024 PT-5 is heading our way, it's not on a collision course with Earth. No need to start prepping for an asteroid apocalypse just yet. So what makes 2024 PT-5 so interesting if it's not about to crash into us? For starters, its size. At about 10 meters in diameter, this thing is relatively tiny in the grand scheme of space rocks. But that's exactly why it's going to become a mini-moon. You see, smaller asteroids like this one are more likely to get caught in Earth's gravitational pull, at least temporarily. Bigger asteroids zoom past us too quickly, like they've got somewhere more important to be. But smaller ones? They're more prone to getting snagged by Earth's gravity for a little while, which is exactly what's going to happen with 2024 PT-5. Think of it like this. Earth and the Moon are like a tag team of gravitational forces. When a small asteroid comes near, it enters a tug of war with our planet's gravity. If the asteroid's speed and trajectory are just right, like they are with 2024 PT-5, it gets pulled into orbit, briefly becoming a mini-moon. It's kind of like Earth saying, hey, come hang out for a bit, and the asteroid obliges, but only for a short stay before heading back on its way. But let's pause for a second. Why should we care about a 10-meter rock floating around us for a couple of months? Well, for one, it's a chance to study something that usually stays far away from us. We don't often get the opportunity to observe a near-Earth object, NEO, so closely. Even though 2024 PD-5's stay will be short, it gives scientists a rare window to track its movements and better understand how these little space rocks interact with Earth's gravity. Plus, events like this help us fine-tune our asteroid detection systems. Think of it as a live drill. Every time a mini-moon shows up, we get better at spotting and tracking asteroids, and that's key for planetary defense. After all, the more we know about how these objects behave, the better we can predict, and hopefully prevent, any that might pose a real threat. Speaking of tracking these tiny travelers, how exactly does this whole capture process work? Picture Earth as having a gravitational bubble around it. When an asteroid like 2024 PT-5 gets close enough, it enters this bubble and starts to feel the pull of our planet's gravity. But, unlike our permanent moon, which is locked in a stable orbit, Mini moons are more like visitors. They don't stick around forever because their orbits tend to be super elliptical, kind of like someone doing a quick loop before speeding off again. For 2024 PT-5, the timing is pretty precise. It's set to get caught by Earth's gravity at the end of September 2024 and will make one full orbit around the planet over the course of about 53 days. After that, it's off, slingshotting back into its own orbit around the sun by mid-November. Blink, and you might miss it, but for astronomers, this is a huge deal. Now, here's where things get really cool. 2024 PT-5 is part of a group of asteroids called the Arjuna Group. These asteroids have orbits that are pretty similar to Earth's, which means they have a better chance of getting pulled in by our planet's gravity. And the fact that 2024 PT-5 is a natural object, meaning it's not space junk like an old satellite, makes it even more interesting. Its natural orbit isn't influenced by things like solar radiation or atmospheric drag, so it's a perfect candidate for becoming a mini-moon. But this isn't the first time Earth's played host to a temporary companion. There have been other mini-moons before, 
and each one has taught us something new. One of the most famous examples is 2006 RH-120. Back in, you guessed it, 2006, this little guy orbited Earth for about a year. It was smaller than 2024 PT-5, only about 3 to 6 meters in diameter, but its capture gave astronomers a front row seat to the dynamics of how small objects interact with Earth's gravity. Then, there was 2020 CD3, another mini-moon that was slightly larger, about 1 to 2 meters wide, which hung out with Earth from 2018 to 2020. What's awesome about these past mini-moons is how much we've learned from them. They've shown us that Earth's gravity can temporarily capture small asteroids, even ones we didn't expect to come so close. This process is not just fascinating. It's crucial for understanding the potential risks from near-Earth objects. After all, every time one of these space rocks gets snagged in Earth's gravitational pull, we get better at predicting how close other objects might get in the future. And let's be real, the more we know about these small bodies, the better we can protect our planet from anything that might actually pose a danger. And who knows, studying mini-moons like 2024 PT-5 could lead to some pretty exciting possibilities down the road. These small asteroids might hold valuable resources, and learning more about them could help pave the way for future missions to mine asteroids, or even develop new technologies to deflect asteroids that are on a collision course with Earth. It's not just about understanding these cosmic visitors, it's about using that knowledge to potentially save the planet. Talk about high stakes. As we look forward to 2024 PT-5's brief visit, it's a reminder of just how dynamic and ever-changing our universe is. These tiny space rocks come and go, but each one teaches us something new about our cosmic neighborhood. And who knows? The next mini-moon might just be the key to unlocking new mysteries of space or even safeguarding Earth from a future asteroid threat. So, what do you think? Are you excited about Earth's next mini-moon? What do you think we could learn from it? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And hey, if you're into cool space stuff like this, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell so you never miss an update. Who knows? Maybe we'll be talking about the next mini-moon sooner than we think.